you're writing. It sounds really interesting. It's called the Fabu List. List it, live it, love your life. It's a self-help memoir about reinvention at midlife. Being a mom to three kids is a full-time job and then some. That's not all I do. I actually am a writer. We have Susan Campbell Cross here, who is going to tell us about 10 fun ways to beat the blues. Yes, I do want to talk about how to get your happy on. Hey everybody, I'm Bobby Flay. This summer, I've teamed up with Hellman's for the Real Food Project. It's really tricky to find something that everyone in the family will enjoy. Hey, I'm Curtis Stone, and I'm joined by the delightful Susie. Here you go. Thank you. Roasted chicken, I've taken away the skin and the bones and just left with this beautiful chicken meat. That's healthy. It's good. Yeah. Good for you. You're never ever going to be any younger than you are right now. So whatever whatever it is that you think you'd like to tackle or try or step outside your box to go after, you've got to just do it. The three kids usually don't want to eat the same thing. It's just a lot of brain work for very early in the morning. So I make the coffee first. The idea is to really get people to eat the same thing at the family table. Put maybe half of those pimentos right into the mayonnaise. It smells pretty good, huh? These are beautiful. Give it a try. It's really good. <laughs> yeah, I've got a bit of chopped up chili pepper here. So I don't know if you like it spicy, but I kind of do. I like it really spicy. You do? I okay. do. Here's another really good one, comfort food. Mm. It's called comfort food for a reason. Yeah, it is really comforting. Like... But as you know, I'm lifestyle editor of Shave Magazine, <laughs> so I can't encourage people in good faith to go out and eat, you know, huge amounts of macaroni and cheese. Planned spontaneity. Planned spontaneity. Uh, planned spontaneity. Isn't that funny? It sounds like an oxymoron, but when you get to this stage of life, you almost have yeah. to plan your spontaneity or you'll never do okay, anything. I'm totally doing that when I get off the phone. If you're looking for vitamin C, let's say it's cold and flu season, you know how it is as a mom when you've got kids sick at home with the flu. The whole key to being a good host is to have your guests think that you spent a lot of time in the kitchen when you didn't. <laughs> Love that. So, All right. let's see whether they're any good. Bon appetit. Thank you. Mm. Oh, I forgot. Mm. There's one rule in this kitchen. Whenever I cook, you have to clean. Are you joking? I cook, you clean. So all right, one time. I love that rule. What were the times nice. when you were just feeling great? And I bet you'll think of what the music of that time was. Yeah. And so on my playlist, I've got uh, Jump by Criss Cross. You know, Criss Cross will make it. I'm not even going <laughs> to <Yeah. laughs> torture you with that right now. If you were to take a piece of paper and just jot down, you know, like 10 fun things that you could do that don't cost a lot or that don't take a lot of time to get to, take those tear them into little pieces of paper, fold them up, and tuck them away in a drawer, and then just reach in, don't look, reach in, and draw one out randomly. I love that idea. We need more people like you on the board. Uh.